Further, with each day with nominations being filed and candidates being announced, the political temperature has soared to an all new level in the state. Political parties are leaving no stone unturned to ensure that they taste success in this battle royale. Wednesday is the last day for filing nominations for the 49 seats that go to polls during the first phase of Bihar Assembly elections on the 12th of next month. Political parties have now pressed the pedal on declaring their candidates with a sense of urgency. The Rashtriya Lok Samta Party declared the names of two candidates on Tuesday and changed one as well. So, one candidate has changed in the accident and we have announced two other candidates today. Bappu Yadav's Jan Adhikar Mocha has also declared a list of 15 contestants. But the Nitish Kumar-led Mahagat Mandan has not come out with any official list of candidates so far. JDU and RJD are reportedly getting their candidates to file nominations along with their party symbols. But the fear of rebellion by those denied tickets is keeping the Nitish Lalu combined from coming out with an official list. For the record, the JDU claims all is well. When the thinking of the people is wrong, we will be wrong with the thinking. आज हम लोग उम्मीद करते हैं कि आज हम लोग की सोची घोषित हो जाएगी सभी सीटों पर। Meanwhile, the NDA has nearly completed the work of declaring candidates with 240 names out among a total of 243 seats. The BJP has named 153 candidates from its quota of 160 seats. Ramanas Paswan's LJP has declared names of 21 candidates so far. Jitana Manji's Hum has declared its candidates for a full quota of 21 seats. Upendra Kushwaha's RLSP has declared names of 19 candidates. Reports of murmurs of discontent over seat sharing among NDA allies have been denied by top leaders. हम कहते हैं हर पार्टी में चल रहा है होली का समय है कौन रंग कहां से निकलेगा आ रहा है नहीं आ रहा है वो चलता है उसमें क्या है? The third front is also making efforts to bolster its chances in Bihar's contest. Uttar Pradesh Chief Minister Akhilesh Yadav reached Patna on Tuesday and talked up achievements of his state government there. आज बिहार की जनता को जरूरत है एक सेकुलर रास्ते की। बिहार की जनता की जरूरत एक सोशलिस्ट रास्ता हो। और मैं ये कह सकता हूँ जितने लोग बैठे हैं और ये गठबंधन जो आगे काम करेगा ये सेकुलर और सोशलिस्ट रास्ता बिहार में तय करने का काम। Clearly, the battle for Bihar is peaking to a political crescendo, which will only get louder in the coming days. News Night Desk. DD News. Our correspondent Shailendra Mishra is joining us from Bihar. Shailendra, we've told our viewers how the political battle is brewing up in Bihar. Nominations are being filed. We've also seen omissions and replacements being made when we talk of the list of the candidates which were announced. Uh, very quickly, summarize for us uh, the poll fever in the state. तो बिल्कुल आप जानते हैं कि पहले चरण के नामांकन का कल अंतिम दिन है ऐसे में यह कह सकते हैं कि जो नामांकन बहुत तेजी से हो रहा है और कल कई जो है अहम नामांकन होने हैं उसमें अगर हम इंडिया की बात करें तो बीजेपी के जो तमाम कद्दावर नेता हैं वो भी अलग अलग जो मौजूद रहेंगे नामांकन के वक्त भागलपुर में रविशंकर प्रसाद रहेंगे कल जो है झारखंड के मुख्यमंत्री आ रहे हैं जो है रघुबर दास वो मौजूद रहेंगे और एक तरह से कहें बहुत जो है फीवर चढ़ा हुआ है लेकिन जो सबकी निगाहें हैं खास तौर पर वो इस बात को लेकर लगी रही आज दिन भर की कब नीतीश की अगुवाई वाला महागठबंधन औपचारिक तौर पर जो है अपने उम्मीदवारों के नाम का ऐलान करेगा ये कहा गया कि शाम तक ऐलान हो सकता है लेकिन माथा पच्ची जारी रही हालांकि हम जानते हैं कि पिछले दो दिनों से सिम्बल दिए जा रहे हैं जे डी और की तरफ से और नामांकन भी हो रहा है जे और आर के उम्मीदवारों का पहले चरण के लिए तो ऐसे में जो है लगातार ये कयास लगाए जाते रहे कि आखिर क्यों जो है औपचारिक तौर पर उम्मीदवारों के नाम का ऐलान नीतीश की अगुवाई वाला महागठबंधन नहीं कर रहा है हालांकि ये कहा गया कि जो है एक तरह से आम सहमति बनाकर तीनों दल एक साथ ऐलान करना चाहते हैं इसलिए देरी हुई लेकिन अभी तक ऐलान नहीं हुआ है और ये माना जा रहा है कि विद्रोह की जो आशंका थी आप जानते हैं कि पहले ही आर और जे के कई उम्मीदवारों जो जो उम्मीदवार बनना चाहते थे उन्होंने विद्रोह किया उस आशंका के मद्देनज़र एक रणनीति बनाई गई कि सिम्बल दे दिया जाए उम्मीदवारों को और ऐलान औपचारिक फिलहाल टाल दिया जाए अब देखना होगा कि कब तक ऐलान होता है औपचारिक तौर पर जहां तक जेडीयू आरजेडी और कांग्रेस का सवाल है प्रीति All right, Shalindra. Thank you for that update. That was our correspondent, Shalindra Mishra, summarizing for us 
the poll fever in Bihar. He told us that tomorrow is a big day. We told you that uh, it is the last day for filing uh, the nomination papers for the 49 seats that go to polls during the first phase. Also, he tells us that uh, many BJP stalwarts are expected to file the nomination papers tomorrow as well. Also, we will have Ravi Shankar Prasad, uh, who will be present in Bhagalpur tomorrow. He also told us that there could be a possibility that uh, the Gatbandan, the Maha Gatbandan candidates could be announced. But then he also uh, underlined the fact that there were uh, reports of rift between the three parties of this Gatbandan, but the, eventually they decided that there would be unison when they uh, announced the list of the candidates uh, and they and they rubbished the reports of this uh, bickering within the party, uh, within the Maha Gatbandan. So we'll have to see how the day pans out tomorrow. That was our correspondent Shailendra Mishra joining us from Bihar and updating us about the poll fever in the state. We'll get to other news as well. after